Bless you all, beloved brothers and sisters. I welcome you all again into the presence of the Almighty God. And I thank you all for your love in this ministry. And I pray may the hands of the Lord continue to be resting upon you and make a way for you when there is no way. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today, God has come to speak to someone and say, you don't know the tactics that you are supposed to use to win the soul of God. But today, I have a good news for you. According to Mark 5, verse 6, But when he saw Jesus afar of him, he rise and worship him. This is a man that was possessing by a spirit of demonic. But the moment he saw the Son of God, he recognized him. And inside that difficult, he was worshiping God. And that moment, God showed him mercy. Today, brothers and sisters, not every time you need to be mormon. Not any time, every time you need to be complaining about God. Why me? Why me? You need to stood up from that situation and say, Lord, I thank you. Worshiping God is a weapon that makes a way for you. Worshiping God is a key that can open any door that the enemy has locked. When you see the David, the story of King David, if a king can dance and a cloth pulled from his body, what about you? And that was the key that made David to be conquering any battle that he come across. Today, may God make you, you to recognize him in time uh, so that you will know the strategy that you can use to win the soul of God. As you hear my voice today, it shall be well with you and your soul. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. I will leave you all from here with peace, brothers and sisters. Run unto him and hold God strong. Peace of the Lord. I live with you. Bye-bye.